day five, what are the principles and workflow of software development? So we've been talking about web apps now, we've been talking about the different types of coders and the technology of working together called Git. And now we're gonna take a couple of steps back talking about two philosophies of software development and the framework. So let's start with the philosophy. Oh, okay, not that far back. Okay, that, that's a good start. Well. Before 2001, developers were using something called a waterfall method of software development. In short, waterfall method of software development is something like you have some requirements and this is what you want the software to do. And then you, you build that software and you test it and then you release it. Um, and, and you know, the, the plan is, is kind of like in the beginning of that process uh, and you kind of follow that plan. And to understand the waterfall approach, you know, think about going to a vacation. And then, you know, before the vacation, you basically plan everything down to the second and you leave zero room for both unexpected good things and bad things to happen. And, you know, when you go on the vacation, you hurt yourself, you hurt your leg and you cannot be moving around as much as expected. The waterfall method of planning would be basically like just carry out the plan, right? Just build the software. And this is kind of the criticism towards the waterfall method because it can be pretty hard in the beginning of the project to know what the requirement is and, you know, unexpected things might happen along the way. In 2001, 17 people met and wrote something called the Agile Manifesto and they were tired of this waterfall method and uh, you know they wrote some principles that they wanted to use in software development. The Agile Manifesto has four values and 12 principles. And I'm gonna go through them one by one, but you don't need to remember all of these. I just want you to get a gist of what the Agile Manifesto is all about. So first, the values. The four values are individuals and interactions over processes and tools, working software over comprehensive documentation, customer collaboration over contract negotiation, and responding to change over following a plan. And the principles of the Agile Manifesto are, one, our highest priority is to satisfy the customer through early and continuous delivery of valuable software. Two, welcome changing requirements, even late in the development. Agile processes harness change for the customer's competitive advantage. Three, deliver working software frequently, from a couple of weeks to a couple of months, with a preference to, to the shorter time scale. Four, business people and developers must work together daily throughout the project. Five, build projects around motivated individuals, give them the environment and support they need and trust them to get the job done. Six, the most efficient and effective method of conveying information to and within a development team is face-to-face -face conversation. Seven, working software is the primary measure of progress. Eight, Agile processes promote sustainable development. The sponsors, developers, and users should be able to maintain a constant pace indefinitely. Nine, continuous attention to technical excellence and good design enhances agility. 10, simplicity, the art of maximizing the amount of work not done is essential. 11, the best architectures, requirements, and designs emerge from self-organizing teams. 12. At regular intervals, the team reflects on how to become more effective, then tunes and adjusts its behavior accordingly. One popular Agile framework for managing work is called Scrum. In Scrum, teams has what is called sprints. A sprint is a time box effort to get something done. A sprint is usually one week, two weeks, or a month. The team are using a scrum board to organize their work. A scrum board is simply a board with several columns that are used to organize tasks. One final important part is daily scrums. A daily scrum, sometimes called a daily stand-up, is a meeting where every person in the team is answering three questions. What did you do yesterday? What will you do today? And do you have any obstacles? So remember today, waterfall development is when the requirements are set in the beginning and not changed in the development 
Agile development is when the requirements can change even late in the process, and it's a more iterative process, meaning there's an openness to change. And Scrum is a framework for working together in an agile way. So today, if you have a couple of extra minutes, you can reread the Agile Manifesto.